Brightline Having successfully launched a rail line connecting Orlando to Miami, reaching impressive speeds of up to 125 miles per hour, this ambitious project faced significant skepticism, yet it has now proven its viability and effectiveness. The Orlando to Miami line stands as a major milestone in U.S. rail transportation showcasing the potential for high-speed systems to offer efficient and rapid travel options. Building on this success, Brightline is now embarking on another groundbreaking project, Brightline West. This high-speed rail line will connect Las Vegas to Southern California, ultimately linking to Los Angeles with trains reaching speeds of up to 186 miles per hour. Scheduled for completion by 2028, the Brightline West project will span 218 miles, or 315 kilometers, from Las Vegas to Rancho Cucamonga. From there, passengers will continue their journey to Los Angeles on the Metrolink train, a ride that takes around one hour. This entire trip, which typically takes five hours by car, will be reduced to just three hours by train. Driving on Interstate 15, or I-15, is often plagued by heavy congestion. The new rail line will provide a faster, more efficient alternative, constructed alongside I-15. Much of it will be built between the existing roadways, minimizing additional environmental impacts since it utilizes areas already affected by the I-15 corridor. Funding for this project will not rely solely on public money. Private bonds and capital will cover most of the costs, with only $3.5 billion expected from government funding. In June 2023, the Brightline West project received a significant boost with $25 million in federal funding. One of the most challenging sections of the route will be the Cajon Pass, presenting engineering and construction difficulties due to its rugged terrain. Despite these challenges, the Brightline West high-speed rail project promises to transform travel between Las Vegas and Southern California, offering a faster, more efficient, and environmentally friendly alternative to driving. Brightline is not just building railways, it's paving the way for the future of transportation, something that the United States has been lacking in the modern era of transport despite its large landmass. This project could open the doors to Americans using high-speed networks in their everyday lives, maybe even connecting the East Coast to the West Coast. Thanks 